And we're down to the final match of the weekend. It's the Open Singles Final, and this should be exciting. There's Ryan Moore of the USA on the left, and Frederic Collignon of Belgium on the right. The matchup that the fans have been waiting for around the world, both here and on live streaming. The young 19-year-old American versus the greatest player in the history of the sport, Frederic Collignon. Shot back down the middle, knocked down by Ryan Moore, and Ryan reels it in, has possession of it in the goal area. Of course, still, Frederick Collignon's serve table is a huge favorite over Ryan. Shot to the far side, retrieved by Moore. It's one three out of five match to decide the 2009 Tech Ball World Champion. And again, it just emphasizes just how good of a multi-table player Ryan Moore is becoming. We saw it at the World Cup when he performed well on Tech Ball, Garlando, Roberto Sport, and Bonzini. Now we're seeing it here now as he reaches the finals of the Tech Ball World Championships here at the beautiful Setter Parks in Lockensward, Netherlands. Great shooter from goal. It's going to be difficult to score against Frederick Collignon. He did hit it off a man there into the goal. It's 1 0. Nice man says, Sean, so is how much I know. Ryan Moore leading 1 0 here in game number one. Shot down the middle, blocked away, and grabbed. By Moore. That's going to be the key. Ryan Moore's got to keep Frederick Collignon out of the goal. And that's not an easy chore for anyone to do. The most versatile player in the history of the sport. And he finds a hole down the middle here. It's 1-1. Simplifying the five on this table and brushes this one through the lane. He'll set it up looking to regain the lead. Moore taking his time and finds that hole down the middle. It's 2-1. Yep. And Moore steals it away. Back. Nice save by Moore in the goal area. Frederick Collignon defeated Ronnie Falk and then Rocco Robin to get to this point. And Ryan Moore defeated Michael Blazic and then that great match against Christian Sula. the table. 2 1 lead for Ryan Moore here in the opening game of the Open Singles Final. Pass along the wall by Colignon, and Fred will set it up looking to tie it up at two. Shot attempt block, hops up in the air, stabbed forward, ends up in the goal area of Collignon. He'll begin to work it back up the table once again. Knocked down by Moore. Comes back to Frederick Collignon using the left hand as he does so well, shooting the ball this time into the corner of the goal on the near side. It's 2 2. Moore coming back through the lane. Looking to regain the lead. Ryan Moore. Try to come to the near side. Collignon raced him out of that corner and took it away. Fred working it up the table. Goes along that outside wall. Now brings it to the near side. Able to pass it along the wall. Five rod to three rod. Now looking to go three rod to the back of the goal.
and he'll call a timeout. Two two here in the first game. Frederick Colignon puts the ball into play. And finds that hole down the middle. First game, and he does, faking to the far side, then coming deep to that near corner. It's 3-3. Ryan Moore hanging with the great Belgian. And Ryan, there Frederick Colignon is going to utilize his second and final timeout. Both of his timeouts, puts the ball back into play, able to pass it along that near wall. Fred will set it up now, looking for the lead. Try to come to the near side, blocked and taken away by Moore. And Ryan to the short side into the goal. Beautiful shot. We talked about his abilities to shoot the ball from the two row. That's two in this first game. And that's against the guy who plays pretty good defense. 4-3 lead here in the first game for Ryan Moore. Remember, it's single elimination. It's just one set. One three out of five. One race to three. That shot off that inside wall. It's 4-4. Four, four. When you have Colignon down, you need to take advantage of those opportunities. Ryan Moore, if he's going to win this match, needs this ball right here. And Ryan's going to call a timeout. Ryan Moore, possession on the five rod, will put the ball back into play. Stroking it back to that far corner. Game one goes to Frederick Colignon. So Frederick Colignon wins the opening game 5-4 as we move to game two. Colignon steals it away. Finds that hole down the middle, it's 1-0. So Frederick Colignon wins the opening game 5-4, comes out to get the first point of the second game. Nice grab on the three row by Moore. Ryan walking it out to the far side, back to the middle. Tried to go back to that far corner, blocked and taken away by Colignon. Now, possession in the goal area. As 
passing it down the middle of the table, grabbing it on his five row, moving into the forward position, passing it through. He can't hold on to it. Brian Moore now in possession of the ball in the goal area. Taking a look at the bank. Now taking a look at the pull shot. And firing home the pull shot. So as we mentioned early on, it should be very easy for Ryan Moore to score from goalie against Frederick Collignon. Coming right back is Collignon. Shot at him, blocked by Moore. Comes back to Fred on the five. 1-1 one, one here in the second game. Just one game to nothing in favor of Frederick Collignon. Steal. Ryan brushes it nicely through the lane. Looking for the lead. And he finds it. Stroking home that front pin effort. It's 2-1. There is no quit in this kid. He's going to fight Colignon right to the end. Win or lose. Scoops through the lane by Fred. Colignon will attempt to tie it at two. And he does, stroking it far to that corner of the goal on the far side. It's 2-2. Referees, by the way, for this match are Tom Yor and Yuri Orton. More along the wall. Both of these players competed last week in Las Vegas in the United States and Ryan Moore fires that one home, it's 3-2. And hopped on a plane and headed here. Frederick Colignon going home to Belgium first. Ryan Moore coming to the Netherlands. Here they are a week later, competing once again at an international event. Look at a tied up at three, it's Frederick Colignon. And he finds that hole down the middle once again. What a sweet shot that is. It's 3-3. Continues to get the ball. He can stay one step of Colignon, but the shot attempt blocked away comes all the way back down in the goal area. Ryan going with that quick set to the near side. Sliced to the short side, but Frederick Colignon had moved back there anticipating that shot. He makes the block and takes it away. That one stabbed off the corner of the goal. Colignon able to rebound it. Attempt blocked by Moore. Again, looking to go the two rod to the five rod. Instead, he puts it on Golden. Ryan Moore somehow gets a man on it to keep it out. What a great defensive play there. And then he whips out the long pull shot. Great play by Ryan Moore as he saved that ball from going in somehow. Whipped out the long pull shot for a 4-3 lead. What a great play by the young man from Lexington, Kentucky. Colignon coming back. Colignon executing the shot. It's 4-4. Again, Ryan Moore has an opportunity right here, as he did in that first game. When you're at 4-4 against Colignon, you have got to take advantage of that situation. You have to put him away. If not, you know he will, and he'll do it pretty quickly. What a brilliant play by Ryan Moore, reflecting back and somehow keeping that ball out of the goal and setting it up and letting loose with that long stroking pull shot. But still, it's 4-4. No matter how great you play against Colignon, doesn't mean you're going to win. Play your best game of your life and still come up short against the greatest player of all time. Ryan Moore with a couple of pass opportunities, both of them blocked. Again along the wall, and Ryan able to hold on to it. And he's going to go ahead and use a timeout. Possession of the ball on the five row of Ryan Moore. Put it back into play, tied up at four, trailing one game to nothing in this open singles final at the 2009 Tech Ball Worlds. Ryan 
this here. Again, along the wall, this time successful. Ryan Moore for a second game win. Walks it around. Tried to go down the middle, blocked and taken away by Colignon. Fred, looks like he's gonna shoot it. Slicing effort wide of the goal, grabbed by Moore. Ryan has scored four in the first two games from goal. Make it five as he whips out that pull shot. It's one game apiece. Wow. Game underway, tied up in a game apiece. We've got ourselves a battle here on table number one. The great Frederick Collignon versus the talented young American Ryan Moore, and Moore able to get on the scoreboard first here in game three. Collignon looking to tie it up. And he does, hammering it out there to that far corner. It's 1-1. One, one. And Collignon now up 2-1 here in the third. And after losing a game so often, Frederick Collignon Steps up his performance another notch. 99 out of 100 times he comes back and wins that next game. Ryan Moore, so poised for his age. And Ryan able to tie it up at two. Right pick, bad spot. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Two, two here in the third game. One game apiece. The open singles final. And Frederick Holignon is going to step away and use a timeout. What do you want to do? Liege, Belgium's Frederick Holignon. Possession of the ball on the five row. We'll put it back into play. Tied up at two here in game three. Pass attempt knocked down by Moore. Rico once again has his pass partially blocked but those quick hands able to reel it in on the three row. Ryan Moore on the defensive. Frederick Colignon looking for a 3-2 lead. Walks it all the way out to the far side back to the middle. And finds that hole to the far side. Well, Ryan guessed near side and committed himself to it. Colignon able to exploit the far corner is 3-2. Ryan's just got to stay with him. Walking it around. Try to go down the middle, blocks, grabbed. Oh, what a grab on the three roll by Colin Young. How did he catch that ball? It's on the back pin, tries the back pin. Blocked away, comes back to him. Ryan Moore was looking to Tom Yore for a jar call, but there was none. And Collignon now looking for a two-goal lead. And he gets it, stroking it all the way out to the far side. As soon as I went to do it, you went like this with the five. You know you did, Fred. I didn't see it. You know you did, Fred. You went like this as soon as I was going for the ball. I did not see it. Okay, well, don't confuse me. You didn't see it. I didn't mind it. It's okay. Time out. It's okay. You didn't even know. You did. I'm not saying you did, but it's okay. I don't even know. What we were talking about. As I was going for the ball, your hand on the fire bar, you started doing this. If I did it, I'm sorry. Okay. You did. Okay, so Ryan Moore asking referee Tom Yore about a hand gesture after the shot by Frederick Colignon, the miss. And he says it was a distraction. There was no call. And then we resume play. The ball stolen away by Colignon.
Right now with a chance to win game three. Try to go to the far side, more with a block. Red gets it back, sets it up. Try to come back down the middle, more with a block, stab wide of the goal. And Ryan Moore now playing with a little more intensity in his eyes. He's hit five from this position so far. And puts that one on goal. Rebounded by Colignon. Red positioned perfectly that time. Shot. Blocked by Moore. Comes back to Colignon. He's looking to shoot. Red gets it back. Matching Ryan Moore's intensity right now, but Ryan able to take it away. Looking to pull within one from snake shot position, Ryan Moore. Shot attempt blocked away, grabbed on the five by Colignon again, so quick, and the handle. Colignon along the wall, another chance for Fred to take a two games to one lead. And he does. Finding that hole to the near corner. Frederick Collignon surges ahead. Two games to one. Ryan Moore is going to take a walk and think about coming back and getting back into this match with a fourth game win if he can. All right. Collignon won the first game. Ryan Moore won game two. And the third game went in Collignon's direction. Ryan Moore needs this game to stay alive as he puts it into play. Ryan tried to brush through the lane, taken away by Collignon. Fred, first pass along the wall, blocked, second one through the lane crisply. And Collignon sets it up, looking for point number one of game number four. Shot attempt here, blocked away, comes down the table where it's grabbed by Moore. Ryan sets it up. Trying to go down the middle again, really not selling it. Red stayed home, made the block up into the air and off the table. That straight works best when the player, the opponent, thinks you're going to the corner. Ryan really didn't look like he was in position to go to a corner there. Slicing effort, blocked back into the goal by Ryan Moore with the five row, it's one nothing. Ryan Moore is fearless. He does not care who he's playing. It doesn't bother him. He doesn't enter into this match thinking anything but that he can win it. And so often you see Frederick Colignon's opponents entering a match already thinking, hey, I'm playing the greatest player in history sport. I, I have no chance. That thought never enters Ryan Moore's mind. Moore now with possession on the five. Fans would love to see this one go to a fifth game. Ryan Moore's going to have to get a little crisper on that five row. Colin Hill beautifully through the lane. Great control he has. Fred now setting it up and stroking it home to the far side. It's 1-1. Rushing it through the lane. Big shot here in the fortunes of Moore. Quick shot to the near side. Rattles into the goal. He'll take it. It's 2-1. Hey, 2-1 lead. Ryan Moore here in the fourth game. Two games to one lead for Frederick Collignon. Fred just keeps continuing to work the five and work the three. And find that very tight split hole. How does he know that hole is there? Ryan Moore switched. Colignon immediately shot it. Found that angling split hole off that front pin set. It's now 2-2. Ryan nicely through the lane. He'll set it up looking to regain the lead. Ryan Moore. Don't sit back down the middle. It's 3-2. Yeah. Well, can't hold on to the pass. 
Moore leading 3-2. Let's set it up in full shot position on his two row, upper right hand corner of the table. Shot attempt rattles down the table. Ryan jumps into that forward position, grabs the rebound, sets it up. And strokes it to the far side. It's 4-2. Two here in the fourth. Back comes Colignol. Fred shot attempt. There's Ryan waiting for it, making the block and taking the ball away. Ryan Moore. Shot down the middle on goal. Hops in the air, comes back down on goal. Colignol reaches back to grab it, then banks it off the outside wall with a left hand. Beautiful shot by Colignol. Wow. Ryan Moore. Game point here, if he can get the ball to that three row. Couple of blocks by Colignol. Ryan again. Pass attempt rattles towards the goal. Colignol keeps it out. Gonna shoot it with the right hand this time. No, he's not. Moving to the left hand on the two row. Angling it along that outside wall. He gathers it in on his five. Now bringing it to the near side, looking to advance at five to three, which he does. Opportunity here for Fred to move within one of victory. Front pin position, Colignon hammers it to the far side. It's 4-4. It is championship point for Frederick Colignon. Ryan Moore simply must have this ball to stay alive. I was going to call and I was just waiting to see if you were. And we have a timeout. Moore will put the ball back into play. It is championship point for Colignon. That one not towards the goal. Colignon couldn't grab it, Ryan Moore does. Now sets it up. Slicing effort, blocked by the three of Colignon, comes back to Moore. Full kick off that inside wall, Moore keeps it out with those quick hands. Great save by Moore. Shot on goal, grabs on the rebound by Colignon. Frederick Colignon now with possession on the five, and that usually means that it's going to be on the three row shortly thereafter. But first, Fred will step away and use a timeout. As he puts it into play on his five row, looking to advance it to the three with an opportunity to win the title yet again. Blocked by Moore. Colignon this time successful. Ryan Moore is going to need it. Frederick Colignon for the title. Colignon tried to go down the middle, blocked and taken away by Moore. Shot just off the corner, hops towards the goal. Colignon grabs the rebound. Fred binks it off the inside while stuck towards the goal by Moore. And a well turned over to Ryan Moore. And Ryan will step away and use a timeout with an opportunity to tie this match up to two games apiece if he can convert right here. The crowd is loving this. It's not often that Frederick Colignon is tested at tournaments in Europe. He is being tested today, folks. 10 seconds. We have one left if you want. I'm right on that. 19 year old Brian Moore puts the ball into play, sets it up, looking to extend the match to a fifth and final game if he can. Moore. Soaks it down the middle. It's all come down to one final game here for the 2009 okay, Tech ready? Ball Open Singles World Title. Colony on the right, Ryan Moore on the left, and here we go. What a great match it's been so far. Frederick Colony on with the first scoring opportunity of this, the fifth game. Colony on finds the hold of the near side. It's 1 0. Let's see if Ryan Moore can answer. the wall successfully. Ryan will set it up, looking to tie it at one. He 
He strokes it to the near side. It's 1-1. One, one. Classic open singles final here on table number one. Pulling on for the lead. Chokes it to the far side. It's 2-1. Outstanding table soccer being played. One week ago in Las Vegas, Nevada, Tony Spraderman and Frederick Coligno staged an incredible open singles final. We're seeing some of the same here today, but Coligno now steals the ball away from the five of Ryan Moore. Coligno's five has been spectacular. Always seems to know exactly when and where to pass the ball. Now he looks for a two-goal lead, which is rare in this match. Coligno. Shot attempt blocked by Ryan Moore, but it comes back to Fred. Again, Rico. Calls timeout. Yeah. Possession of the ball on the three rod of Frederick Coligno, who puts it back into play. Again, looking for a two-goal lead. Shooting against Ryan Moore. Tried to flick it between the men. Blocked. Comes back to him. Two blocks in a row for Moore. But not this time. As Colignon finds that hole to the far side. And Fred has surged to hit 3-1. Huge ball right here for Moore. Ready? with him. Now finds himself down by two here in the mid. That one blocked back towards the goal, picked up off the back wall by Colignon. And Fred fires it to the far side. It's 4-1. Ryan Moore will use a timeout. Sets it up looking for the title. Coligno fires it home to the far side in five games in a classic match. Frederick Coligno outlasts Ryan Moore to win the 2009 Tech Ball World Singles Championship.